Alright, I don't know where to put the camera. So, we're gonna try it right here. Uh, you guys are gonna have to let me know how the volume is. I can always fix it in post, but during the live stream, obviously, we gotta work together on that. Start new game! Uh, yes. Uh, what difficulty? Let's do it on medium. Aim assist hot. Aim assist off. The frick? We're superior aimers here, okay? So, when I was setting this up, I was trying to, uh, figure out why it looks like crap. Uh, the texture quality was on low. And I'll tell you what. That, uh... You ever had a game where it doesn't render for you? Like, the, the buildings and stuff like that? That's, that's what it looked like. I'm gonna block stuff. There we go. Yeah, it was like clay blobs everywhere. Everywhere. It was gross. I'm like, why, why is nothing loading in? <laughs> Banger alert! Don't you have a New Bordeaux. A modern city with traditional southern values. I underestimated how far he was going to go. What he was willing to do. Visit the historic French Ward and enjoy local cuisine at one of our five-star restaurants. Killing them wasn't enough. Lincoln Clay was using them to send a message. Or spend the afternoon in the bayou and take in its natural splendor. Sal Marcano had no idea what he was going to unleash. New Bordeaux. Safe. Family oriented fun. Make it your next vacation destination. This city survived the War of 1812, the Civil War, and God knows how many hurricanes. But when Lincoln Clay went after the mob, he inflicted more damage than all the wars and hurricanes combined. Lincoln's mother abandoned him in 1947, a couple of years after he was born. His mother, I heard she was Dominican. I always figured his father was white, maybe even not Italian. Not that it mattered. Back then, if you look black, you black. Same as today, I suppose. He stayed at the orphanage until 1958. Well, when did you meet Lincoln Clay? 1966. I was running black ops out of Laos on behalf of the CIA. He was loaned out to me via joint CIA DOD task force. He's a quiet boy. Good boy. Two Purple Hearts, the Bronze Star, and the Distinguished Service Cross. He served his country with honor and distinction. After the city closed the orphanage, he fell in with Sammy Robinson. Sammy ran the black mob over in Delray Hollow. I can't say I approve. But often colored boys didn't have a lot of options back then. Boys like Lincoln, the ones who've been abandoned, they're always looking for a home. Always looking for a place to belong. I think he thought he'd find it in the army. Thing is, once that's lost, Never get it back again. When he returned from the war, Lincoln ended back up over at Sammy's. Now Sammy owed the Italian mob a whole lot of money. And he needed Lincoln's help. It's a damn shame what happened. It breaks my heart. Hey, that is an incredible opening scene. Cinematics are beautiful. Still 
still say this is the craziest goddamn thing I ever heard. Using real money to rob the feds. Well, hell, man, not like this is our cash. This all came from Skeletta. Besides, peanuts compared to what we're gonna haul out of there. Is everything we need to burn? Yeah, that's it. I grabbed the keys to the truck, then we can get the fuck out of here. How's the volume, chat? We okay? Oh, we got all kinds of stuff. Heck yeah. Um. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna try being here. He's in the other room. Grab him so we can get the hell out of here. Good. Everything sounds okay. It's it's not drowning me out, and it's not too loud for you guys. Okay. He said, "Pick up the keys." Sounds like I got keys on me, to be honest. Go in here. Lincoln, pick up the keys. Yo, I'm working on it, bro. Still not sure about leaving him like this. We came through with the truck just like we asked. We've agreed to partner to make it look good. If you got doubts, I'll take the chance. What? Can I, what can I, oh! Alright then, that's that. God damn. Ah. Uh, okay. Going. You got the keys so you can drive. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. We're driving, baby. Let's go. Nice. There it goes. Alright, so we are in uh, an armored vehicle of some town. sort. We don't need the cops crawling up our asses. My old man wanted us to keep one of the guards alive, help throw the feds off the trail. Like you said, I'll take a chance. Besides, if I learned anything from being over in Nam, if someone's willing to flip sides once, we're probably willing to do it a second time. Fuck you in the process. Can we just willy nilly drive? So me like it's GTA? The craziest thing you saw over there. You don't want to know. Hell, man, I'm a taxpayer. I got the right to know how my money's being spent. Oh, Georgie Marcano pays taxes. Damn right I do. That's how they got Al Capone, and I ain't going to prison for no fucking tax bill. Huh? So come on, you gonna answer the question or what? We, uh. We on the coast of Quang Nai. Evacuating the civvies for Charlie overran everything. Anyway, we get him onto a medical ship. This woman walks up. She's got a baby Story in one time. hand and the leash to a pig in the other. She starts up the ramp, and the MP stops her and tells her, you can only bring one thing on board. So she tosses the baby into the water. MP goes ape, tells someone dive in after the kid, starts screaming at the woman, wants to know what the fuck she's thinking. You know what she says to him? She says, I can always have another baby. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, man, you asked. He did. Yeah, but I thought you were going to tell me a story about some gook getting his dick blown off or something. I mean, god damn. It's not a fault. This game is very rough, think. by the way. So the if you're sensitive, there, this Jesus ain't the game Christ. for you. One day you're raising cattle, tending your rice. Next day everything bombed flat. You put people up against the wall. They will do anything to survive. That better have been one delicious fucking pig. If the More Llama channel was monetized, this would be one of those that I would have to, uh... Why'd you get out? Yo, why does that guy have a big head? You see that? Okay, there's somebody in this truck. They literally got out of the truck. Um, but it, I'd have to go through and I'd have to select, like, everything when it comes to, like, vulgarity. <sighs> oh, that dude's got a big head, too! It's the same guy! That dude's got a big head right there, too. Alright, we're making room. We're making room. Out the way. Seems like we can kind of GTA our way around. Guards at the Missouri probably won't be too keen on you waltzing around with that piece of yours. I'll just leave it under the seat. 
Alright, no guns. Got it. Is there a way that I I have to leave it or Time to see if these forged IDs are worth a fuck. Stroll on in. Back it up to the loading dock. Some of these fellas might get a little uh, rough with the language and... Well, I ain't like I've never been called nigger before. Nah, I know, but I'm just saying if I go along with it, ain't nothing poisonous. The only thing I care about is getting our hands on that money. When I say something about being hot, that's when we make our move. All right. He's got a shotgun. You go first. Can I walk? Is there a way to walk? Ah, uh, here we go. I like it when games give you like a way to walk rather than Watch just out, running around. We're part of the Boeing crew. Oh, there we go. What the fuck's this shit heel doing here? Affirmative action. You know how it is. Old country is spinning around a goddamn toilet. You can follow me. As for you, go on and grab those bags off the truck. You'll be carrying them to the burning room. How much y'all bring in? Two hundred thirty-eight thousand five hundred forty-six. Burning room? Small bills. Oh, he going for two. These bags are probably heavy as heck, dude. Appreciate it. You got. You gotta let me through, homie. You check that scatter gun. You packing anything? Still in training. Good. One less goddamn thing for me to worry about. You can pick it up on the way out. Buying rooms down in the cellar. This way. So are we I burning this money? These parts before. Y'all's over in Georgia for a while. He just got out the service. My cousin's been trying to get on here for I don't even want to know what's now. going on down there. Was in the Navy for two tours. Got medals falling out of his ass. Government tells him thanks, but no thanks. That's a crock of shit if I ever heard one. Sad day when a god fearing white man can't get a job. But ain't your nigga who staggers in his hide on the spot. Oh, this way. Well, is it this way? He, po he pointed here. What'd you point that way for? Bastards better not be playing with each other back there. <laughs> Fuck you! Christ, look at that. Didn't know y'all held that much gold. That Washington's been shuffling around on account of the war. It's here, and it gets sent to Dallas, and it comes back. It doesn't make a lick of goddamn sense. Here we are. Time to burn the money. I gotta walk all the way down here multiple. I better not have to. Put those bags on the table there. So we're not burning the money? Never done this detail before. Figured it'd be bigger. I guess the job done. Only time there's a problem is when the flu clogs up. Fuck. That's some heat right there. We used to use coal for it, but a year or so back we switched over to oil. Maintains a more consistent flame. Yeah, some guy come around the house F for a silent on. take then I was gonna look for well, something but uh that works no, I too was neither till I saw this <laughs> what in the Punisher yeah, that guy was an asshole. type of we need to move Danny and Ellis should be coming up any time now uh, give me a second <clears throat> can I take care of those guards Keep your ass down. You don't want them getting a drop on us. I know what the fuck I'm doing. How do I how do I throw him? How do how do I Oh, why? Okay. How do I deal with the guards? Two? Two? Only two? No way. You know that house we've been written out? Called over there last night. Told them I it is only two. 
told them they needed to be out in two weeks. And the man, his name's uh, John. It's the bad guy talking. Saying the lease has the right to a 30 day notice. That's how he's supposed to find a new place in two weeks. So I tell him none of that's my goddamn problem. It's my property, and I'll do with it what I please. And if it brings up that fucking lease. That's one way to do it. Ooh. Switching weapons, uh, hold tab, and then quick swap is page down. Excuse me? Holster is H, or press H in the weapon menu. Page down? Come on, we need to get this Not wrong, it does work. Look at all this waist high cover. Oh, I hope this combination skeleton got us is legit. I'll be damned. All right, go for it, Godzilla. Danny's done drilling. Hey, you gonna pull this off? Oh God, I guess we'll see. Oh, okay, that's perfect. Oh, I thought he threw something. So we gotta, we gotta hold off. Oh, we're just blasting. Okay. I don't have a lot of ammo though. Can I? Uh, nope. Okay, we're learning. Ah, there it is. What are you shooting at? I don't even see him. Oh, there's one there. Yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah, Bloom. Oh, I'm out. Oh! Handguns are way more precise. That guy's still alive. Oh, snap! Uh, yeah, I already know about aim assist. I turned that crap off. There's an M60 in there. Give me that damn thing. Get out the way. Tiny man. Let me at it. How do I... Okay, step one. Expose the lock. Move the mouse until the cursor is in the green zone. Then press left mouse. Step two. Pull the lock. Press E when the indicator is in the green zone. Uh, there. And yeet! Lincoln's a beast. Oh, baby. Yes, sir. No, 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 no. That one. And that. Oh, 200 rounds of pure annihilation. Face way worse than this over a knob. Little smoke don't mean shit. Stay close to the vault. Watch for the drill. I'll deal with these assholes. Yes, I will. Uh, Sammy had men all over the place. Now, one of them worked at a cleaner's and stole the uniforms Georgie Marcano and Lincoln Clay wore on the day of the robbery. Another one was a janitor at the Federal Reserve, and he provided a rough layout. 
The robbery of the Federal Reserve was timed perfectly, and none of it would have been possible without the involvement of Sammy Robinson, Lincoln Clay, and the rest of the black mob. You just come from Vietnam? That's right. I was a Marine in the Pacific. You take it from me. Just because you're home doesn't mean you're back. You understand? People around here, they don't... They don't get it. Never will. <laughs> Keep your ass out of trouble. caught up crossing the bridge. Don't worry about it. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for my stepbrother, Lincoln Clay. You seen him? He used to get ticked off if you were even a minute late. Kiss my ass. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> <laughs> How was the trip? Being how this is the first time in four years and somebody telling me where to go, what to do, or how to do it, it was fucking great. Hmm. <laughs> What's new with the old man? Man, don't even get me started on Pops. He used to pull his head out of his ass. Same as ever then. Brother, you have no fucking idea. Damn, Ellis. She's looking good. Oh, yeah. Just like I left her. Man, even I know not to fuck around with your cop. Mm. All right, come on. I'm ready to go home. <laughs> We're having flashbacks here. Uh, press M to open the map and then mouse left at your destination. Select mission on the map, then click objectives. Okay, I don't know why it's telling us all of that. Oh, here, and then... All right, sneak peek at the map right there. Oh my Same God, this thing right? goes. Ever since we got your telegram about coming home, we've been climbing the walls. What if the plane crashes? What if the train's delayed? What if they call him back? And he goes stand in front of the kitchen window and sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. Don't say nothing about me telling you that. I won't. He'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he gets. Is that you turn? We're gonna keep going this way. Why did it say U-turn? Did, did I legitimately miss a turn? Oh, there's police. I think. Is that the police? Alright. Police awareness. The police will attack you if you commit crimes, act suspiciously, or break traffic laws within range of their awareness. Uh, blue police awareness indicator in the center of the screen. Okay, well, I'm about to hit this car because, uh, you know Totally because of the uh, tutorial pop-up. All right, we're gonna follow the GPS Out the way That was a legal pass I never told him about the weed. That ain't nothing to nobody. But this, I gotta talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need JF up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. We ain't selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with. Fucking around the side. That was pretty serious shit. Knew a couple guys over in Nam who were running it. Wound up pissing off the wrong person. Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. There's no way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgie says he can keep his old man from fighting out. We'll steer clear of the hollow in Frisco, just selling the French wall. Georgie's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, man. Georgie's a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Come in on it with us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. <sighs> I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit, figure some things out. Yeah, all right. 
Talking about heroin. That's the, that's the hard stuff. Once you get settled in, I was thinking we could go to this new club in the French Ward. Maybe double date it. Who the hell am I gonna go with? Your great Aunt Beatrice? Oh, God. <laughs> I ever tell you I accidentally saw her without a shirt once? <sighs> that woman has the droopiest, nastiest tits I've ever seen. <laughs> They were like two sacks of potatoes with nothing in them. Yeah, like that was a fucking accident. Hey, man, fuck you. I was damn lucky to walk away from that one. Anyway, you'll go with Regine. Regine? Believe me, once you see her, you're gonna want to dig right in. <laughs> Matter of fact. She got half the guys in the hollow sna- All right, we're done. Come on, we're going through the front. I ain't having your wall here. I ask you the back door. Look who I found panhandling out in front of the train station. Pleasure, man. Boy, I send you to bring Lincoln Claire home. Not the big nigga who ate him. Well, shit, old man. I finally went somewhere they knew how to cook. <laughs> Welcome home, son. How are you? I'll be better once I get some of that shine in me. I always did love corn whiskey. <laughs> I would like to make a toast. My father used to say that the real worth of a man came from the mark he left on the world. When Lincoln first told me he was joining the military, I was against it. Too dangerous, I say. Let those people fight their own war, I say. But then I realized Lincoln needed to go out and make his mark. And that's precisely what he did. I'm so so proud of you. Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Good to see you! It's so good. Nice seeing you, Lincoln. Oh, I kept you in my prayers. I really appreciate that, Father. <laughs> Now, who wants to get shit-faced? <laughs> Woo! It's hard to explain what it's like coming home from war. Elation. Fear. Guilt. Imagine being trapped in a dark room, and there's no way out. And every fear, every nightmare you ever had is in that room with you. And there's no escape from any of it. And then, one day, a door opens, and you're free to go, just like that. The thing is, you made your peace with your terror and your fear of death. And now part of you is afraid to leave it behind. But what choice do you have? Every soldier has to walk through that door one way or another. Man, <laughs> whiskey's going to in the morning. Hell, man, just sleep it off. The room's the same as he left it. I'm gonna take the basement. <laughs> the basement? Why the fuck you wanna crash down there? I'll see you in the morning. Man, that wall must have really fucked you up. Dude, the father, I'm loving his character, man. And we going to bed now. Why? Why are we running? Okay. That white woman running. <gasps> All right. Uh, there's a safe down here. Why is there a safe down here? 
Uh, where are we going? I assume back upstairs. Ah, found it. I like the map, I think, being on the, the right-hand side of the screen. We barely have two nickels to rub together, now we're paying for all that food. Jesus Christ! Watch that mouth of yours. We wouldn't be in this mess if you were to listen to me. What mess? Not something you need to worry about, Linka. I got it under control. Under control? God damn it, you need to- Boy, I'm not eyes. wanting you again! Have it your way, old man! Let him be. He needs to cool off. You mind telling me what's got him so riled up? We've been having uh, problems with the Haitians. But like I say, I got it under control. Well, trucks all loaded up. I figured we got enough out there for. Should I, should I come back? In honor of your returning to us safe and sound, I made a donation to Father James here. Supplied him with food he can hand out to some of our needier family. Well, I was hoping you'd lend me a hand, Lincoln, and give you a chance to see the neighborhood. This thing with the Haitians, how serious is it? Ah, you know, Ellis. Someone looks at him the wrong way, he's on them like a wet dog. Like I said, I can uh, come back. Nonsense. Lincoln needs to get out. Enjoy the day. Besides, be good for the two of you to spend some time together. Mm. Gone. Those people waiting on their food. Oh, I saw Langan a couple times once he was first back. <laughs> he told me he wanted to leave town, head out to California. Now, he had a friend in the service who could get him a job working at the Mare Island shipyard. And the only reason he came back was to tell Sammy and Ellis goodbye. But then he found out about the trouble Sammy was having with those Haitians. So he decided to stay in help. Those Haitians, they are bad news. No talking Lankin out of it. Whatever else he might have become, Lankin was always loyal. Most likely. Three month apprenticeship to start, then the union lets you in. You tell Sammy and Ellis? Not yet. I'm gonna wait a few days. Didn't want to spring it on them since I just got back. Well, they won't like the head, but they'll come around. You need to do what's best for you. Go ahead and start serving those folks. I'll be back. So the uh, the whole loyalty thing makes sense with uh, Lincoln's it's upbringing. My best, Lincoln. Yes, sir. It, like, it makes complete sense. Bro, he, he didn't have anybody to trust. Warm meal, warm heart. Bow show. Bow show. Thanks. Hello. Hi. You delivering a real blessing here, Lincoln. Thank you. Well, how does everybody know my name? A couple of days back and they already got you working? Ah, I'm happy to do it. Means a hell of a lot to all of us. Don't get old, son. It's a fucking shit show. So I've heard. <laughs> I'll see what I can do about that. Hey there, Lincoln. How are you, Regine? I'm good. Nice to see you around the holler again. Nice to see those big brown eyes again. Uh -oh. Well, they'll be over at my aunt's place with the rest of me. You should stop by. Maybe I'll do that. Lincoln, we got trouble. Run, Regine. Crazy Bro, nigga, shoot done with you, Lincoln. Simon, next. Oh. I was about to say, can I jump over that? We going in. Oh, snap. Motherfuckers over here. This guy had a gun. Just taking him out real quick. You're done. <laughs> Sat that guy down.
Francois Papa Doc Duvalier was elected president of Haiti in 1957. By 1959, he had created a secret police called Tonton Makut, and people started to flee. Uh, most of them settled in the southern United States. Now, mixed in with the good, hard-working people were hardened criminals. Uh, they formed the backbone of what became the Haitian gang. Now, Lincoln found out they set up in the swamps and were led by a man named Baca. Uh, you and Father James done already? We got jumped by the Haitians. It's time you level with me. Tell me what's really going on. Yes. I suppose it is. Six, sir. Uh, seven months ago, folks in the hollow started getting robbed. Money, jewelry, things of that nature. Didn't take long for us to figure out it was the Haitians. Then those batas on the law started going after the lottery. How much money are we talking about? How much? Enough that we're in deep shit with Sal Marcano. Haven't kicked up to him in three months. Jesus Christ. If I deal with them, that gives us time to settle up with Marcano, right? Let me worry about Sal. He and I go way back. But this thing with the Haitians... It's time for it to end. You and Ellis need to handle it. How are we gonna find them? Back in the 20s, folks used to pull salt out of the bayou. They even built themselves a little shanty town. When the depression hit, they abandoned it. That's the only place this could have come from. We're gonna need guns and ammo. Call this number. Do it away from here. No sense tipping anybody off. Or we could sweep the hollow, track down and kill every last one of those cocksuckers, then we wouldn't have to worry about it. The last thing folks in this neighborhood need to see is colored people killing each other. Do this quiet. Away from here. Once we eliminate whoever's running the show, the rest of them will go down on their own. Trust me. All right, soldier boy. I'll follow your lead. Be careful, yeah? Those Haitians are hard people. Do not ever underestimate them. C'est lié que c'est diverse c'est suscite style. It's about to get real, real fast. You sure this is how you want to play this? Last thing they're gonna expect is an attack from the water. You head back round to the row. Stay with the car. I'll meet you over there when this is done. Hope you know what you're doing. Trust me, Ellis. Here in a bit, this will all be behind us. I don't, but we're gonna pretend like we do. Am I just jumping? Swim to the dock. All right, well, in we are. Space to climb. How many men we send in? Two teams. One's gonna hit the bar, the other's going up. Uh, stalking. Stalk your enemies to avoid their attention. Enemy awareness is shown by the white indicator in the center of the screen. So it's just like the police indicator. Get too close to make noise and the enemy awareness indicator will expand and they'll come looking for you. When you're stalking, you'll make less noise and stay out of an enemy's line of sight. While enemies are looking at you, stay in cover. When they've stopped looking, the enemy's awareness indicator will disappear. Boss says if we have to burn down half the hollow to get to Sammy, we're doing it. Stop until that okay, so I got, I got, what, a 1911? Where are they going? Okay. Papa Ligba, open the gate. Okay.
I want this one. The one we started with. If you give me a stealth option, I'm taking it 100% of the time. Yeet. Goodbye. I will blast. I will blast. I think I won't. Is, is he not gonna keep walking? Guess not. Alright, well, we'll take him out here. Yeet! Oh, he got a shotgun. Yoink. Don't mind if I do. Alright, so I doubt we go through the front gate. pixel walking there for a second what is this oh let's go this is the weapon of choice right here oh can i take that knife that knife's nice it does not m matter the era or the game this gun is fire that old man alone. m1 and m14 m1a so we can whistle Dude in the back's gonna see though. Oh. Yep. Oh, it's an automatic. We'll see if they come to us. I don't know if I could have avoided that or not. My ADS sensitivity is kind of low. That's fine. But they're searching. Taking cover. That must have fucking. I can swap shoulders. Yeet! All three of those guys said the same thing. I'll go take him out. Oh Jesus! Let him go free, but don't. It's go time now. I have no idea where they're at. I see you back there. Or somebody over there. Got him. What the heck is happening right now? I'm still worried about that guy that's all the way up there. Did I get him? Nope. Got him. Alright, we're going over here. Done. Ow! Where's my health? Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. So we've got basically like two parts of our health bar. I assume once it goes halfway down past halfway, it can't go back up. Somebody on my right.
I want to see what is this. Oh, it's like Max Payne. Okay. Got him. Look at this moving around. Look at this go. Yeah, that's fine, bruh. That second shot was uh, not even close to on target. Mother sucker! That's two. Heck you, Bloom! Oh, sweet. Oh, and it's auto reloaded? Bad. We gonna make sure. I hear you in there. All right, are we good out here though? I think we are. Yoink. First what? Oh. Wrong button. Fuck you. Who Fuck you. You made a big mistake going after the hollow. The man you're talking about took me in when I had nowhere else to go. You are no better than you. You can't take those stones, you fucking pig! Damn you to earth! Take it easy! Take it easy! Take it easy! He kept me in there, locked in there, day and night. Beat me, use me. I can't, you motherfucker. You and your entire goddamn family. He's dead. He's dead. He can't hurt you anymore. It's over. 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 <laughs> this is never going to be over. Pajam. Fucking Haitians. Dang. Oh, snap. Okay, I tried to kick the door open. It didn't work. All right, so how do we use our Molotovs? That, I, d I don't know how to do that. No. I wonder if it'll tell us. Oh, snap. There we go. Oh, we can aim? Select equipment, uh, Z. Ah, I see. Well, it's raining, so I doubt these are gonna be very effective, but yeet! <laughs> Got him! Yeah, I played Mafia 2 way back when. That game was wild for, you know, the time. Oh, set himself on fire. Let's ride this train. 
Oh, he set him on fire. Yes! Yes! The campfire got him. Alright, I'm gonna go back and get some more Molotovs and then we're gonna head out. I also want to play Mafia 2, the definitive edition. I haven't played that yet. Alright, let's get out of here. What? We're gonna hit him with it. Oh, he fell off. He has no idea where I'm at. Uh, give me room to move up at least. Gotcha. I see you. You still in that door? is that sit him down oh all right we gotta move up oh never mind now we can duck and cover Up, mother sucker. We turned the aggression up on him. All right, where's this other guy at? Getting behind something. Dang, there's a lot of them still. I hear something in there. Put one in, his ear. in my ear? Why are you gonna put it in my ear? He really ran up on me. I wasn't ready for that. I'm fucking empty. Damn it. Oh, I thought that was a headshot for sure. Oh, snap. What a throw. Use this to get closer. Oh, sit down. Don't think about it. Oh, he's shooting the shit out of me. He keeps killing us. Next, dude, I feel like an absolute savage playing Lincoln. I think he's right here. I know there's one more. Oh, took him out, bro. Are you gonna let me in? Drive to Sammy's. Oh, I guess I I'm driving, okay. I drop explosives to destroy pursuing vehicles. I uh, just press G. Simply uh, to throw explosives while driving. Hold G to aim them. Okay. So same way. Always gotta get you out of trouble, don't I? You old? I am. How to go with Baka? We came to an understanding. He stayed dead, not let him. Let's get back to Sammy's. 
can't even tell you how happy Pops is going to be. And this shit with the Haitians has been weighing on him. With them out of the way, things will calm down. Go back to how they should be. Been telling him for months we needed to do something like this, but Pops, he... I don't know. Sometimes I think he's lost the taste for this shit. Just because a man don't rush to violence don't mean he lost something. I know, just makes me wonder what happens after, you know? No, I don't know. Explain it to me. Don't matter if it's a bullet or the hand of God. We all go sometime, right? I suppose. But Ellis, we don't need to talk about I pray that Pops outlives the both of us. But if he doesn't, every motherfucker in the hollow's gonna be looking to us or gunning for us. Just saying we gotta be ready when that day comes. Yeah, well, that's not something we gotta worry about right now. So just cool it with your grand plans, all right? Yeah, all right. I mean, that's the way that it seems, though. They're so, they're so in the community. I like the little, like, prompts on the, on the road that tell you, you know, because you don't have to look at your mini-map. I mean, out of habit, you know, playing, like, GTA crap like that, I do that, but I like the little prompts. It's like, okay, you keep going straight based on your waypoint. Fuck it, it's your car. Bash it up all you want. It's a nice little touch. Excuse me, coming through. Easy clap. The thing Lincoln didn't understand, or maybe want to understand, is that for a man like Sammy, there's always going to be more Haitians. Now, if there wasn't someone going after Sammy, then there was someone else forcing him into a bad situation. It was never going to end. That's how Lincoln ended up working for Sal Marcano. You were right about those Haitians being down by that old salt mine. They won't be bothering us again. It was a mistake sending you down there. I should handle my own business. This isn't any different than what I was doing before I left. You probably don't know this. But every night on the TV, right after the news, they show the names of all the boys killed over there in Vietnam. I'd be sitting in the kitchen eating my supper, watching that list scroll by, wondering if today is the day. I finally see your name. But you never did. Nothing happened to me. There's only so much luck down the web. Sooner or later, I pull up that bucket, there's nothing in it. So, what are we gonna do about Marcano? Damn, his goddamn money one way or the other. Lottery gonna be enough to cover it? The lottery? <laughs> no. But Sal called a bit ago. Wants you to meet him up the country club. Says he's got something in the works. Just square things up between us. The only black folk allowed in there to help. Now, they may not like it, but they're not gonna say no to Sal Marcano. He says you get to come in, you get to come in. Fine. I always did want to see the inside of that place. You need to do whatever Sal asks, yeah? For all our sakes. Yes, sir. This game going hard so far. Driving mode. For more realistic driving experience, advanced players may wish to drive using simulated driving. Uh, that's what I've got. Oh, there's one thing. Uh, wait, slow mode driving is now available. Caps lock? When the meter is full, that green meter? Okay, I want to check something real quick before we move on. Um... Was it in controls? No, I don't think it was. 
Difficulty this. Can't beat that. So go on over there. Tell her I sent you. I know, I know. I'm not supposed to enjoy my coffee on air. I was hoping it was gonna Wait, will it stay up like that? Okay, that's it mm, we'll we'll see when we get to driving. If it's really that much better. I like the the, the wider shot when I'm driving. Because if you, if you guys noticed when I was driving, I kept doing this, and this, and this, and it kept resetting on me. Wait a second. Where am I going? Oh, it's already marked for me. It was showing it, like, right over here. That's why I was confused. Yeah, this is better. I don't feel like I have to keep moving the camera down, 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 down. But yeah, once we finish this game, I want to play through the second one, the Definitive Edition. Because uh, it's been years and years and years and years and years since I've played the second one. Bro, it looks like the apocalypse in my rear view mirror. So does the meter have to be full for me to use it? No. Okay. Oh, it was full. Okay. Are we going up or down? I can't tell. We're, we're just gonna go straight. I ain't got supposed to go up. It's literally right in the middle. Maybe it doesn't matter. Nope, I was supposed to keep going straight. Dude, I know how the roads work in, in this game. I'm so lost. But those on-road indicators I was talking about, it threw me off because it was like straight, but it was on the off-ramp instead of it being straight ahead. Same. I like it, but it can be cleaned up a little bit. <laughs> I just gotta know where I'm going. Learn the roads. Yeet! Oh, we cleared him! can't tell if I like the driving in this game or not. I'm indifferent. Talk to security. Alright. Hopefully this doesn't turn into a shootout. I don't think we're at that point in the game yet. I gotta get out. The fuck you doing up here? Help goes into the back. I'm uh, I'm here to see Mr. Marcano. That's messed up. Lincoln Clay. That a fact? I'll be goddamned. Mind your manners while you're in there, boy. Or there'll be hell to pay you here. You hear? The burnout. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Lincoln Clay! Christ, man, get a look at you! I bet those fucking gooks shit themselves when they saw you coming. Been a long time, Georgie. Oh, no shit has been a long time. I think the last time I saw you was that night over in the French ward, right before you shipped out. <laughs> Damn it, that wasn't a gas. Oh, I seem to remember me and Ellis running from the cops, uh, and Danny ending up in the drunk tank. Hell, man, I bailed him out. Besides, just worth it to knock the hell out of them cracker assholes. <laughs> Smoke? Sure. <laughs> oh, man. Sammy said Mr. Marcano wanted to see me. Mr. Marcano? Shit. Make him sound like a goddamn lawyer. You just call him Sal. Come on, he's in the back. <laughs> A 
should have wore something else. Hey, these squares have a problem with Joe Trez. You can take it up with my old man. He'll tell him to kiss his ass. <laughs> nice thing about having fuck you money. Olivia, I hate to cut this short, darling, but I've got a meeting coming up. Remy, a pleasure as always, sir. Two more glasses. <laughs> Lincoln. Good to see you. This is Vito Scaletta. He's the one I've been telling you about. Come on, Lincoln, sit down. So you served in Vietnam, huh? Yes, sir. Sal tells me uh, you're on a few pieces of tin over there. Well, I served with some good men. Nothing I did would happen without them. Army? Marines? Regular army at first, and then I was recruited to the 5th SFG. Special Forces. I told you it was something else. Now, not that anything's gonna go wrong, but just in case, goddamn, don't you want a man like that on your side? Well, if you're vouching for him, Sal, that's good enough for me. <laughs> Look, I got a couple things to take care of. Thanks for the drink. Christ, that guy's an asshole. <laughs> Fucking carpetbagger. Commission sent him down here from Empire Bay about 15 years back. He's been a pain in my goddamn ass ever since. Well, I guess you're wondering what this is all about. Yeah, Sammy didn't tell me too much. Twice a year, the Feds take old money out of circulation and destroy it. Over the course of the next few days, that money's gonna be delivered here to the reserve in town. And you're gonna hit one of those shipments? <laughs> <laughs> no, sir. We are gonna use that occasion to gain access to their vault. And then steal everything that ain't nailed down. <laughs> Should be six, seven million in there, easy. That's, that's pretty fucking ballsy. <laughs> it's a chance of a goddamn lifetime is what it is. Now, Vito's fronting a lot of the money for the job, and he got us the combination to the vault. Have you had a chance to see Danny? No, not yet. Oh, well, you will. We brought him and his old man in on this, and they're gonna need your help, so go see them. They ain't still in that same place. There's something else we gotta talk about. Now, it's safe to assume you know about the problem Sammy's been having. I took care of the Haitians. Once things settle down, money will start coming in again. You see that right there? That's what I'm talking about. You didn't sit around with your thumb jammed in your ass. You saw a problem, you went out and took care of it. God damn, I take that over money any day of the week. We pay our own way, debts and all. Always have. Oh, hell, son, I know that. I wouldn't expect otherwise. But you know, even after we all evened up, you're still gonna be slopping around in the ass end of this city. Not much of a future in that. But maybe there's a different way forward, you understand? For all of us. What'd you have in mind? I want you to know I mean no disrespect when I say this. Sammy's a hell of a man. But he's not getting any younger. And I'm thinking it's time to make a change. Well, I don't think that Ellis is ready for that kind I'm of not stuff. talking about Ellis. I'm talking about you. I want you to run the holler. <laughs> I can't do that. Well, look here. If you're worried about Sammy, don't you understand? Now, he's always been on the level with me. And this job we're talking about, there's more than enough for him to retire on. He took me in when I had nowhere else to go. Treated me like a son. I'm sorry, Mr. Marcano. I, I can't do that to him. Well, shit, son. I'd be lying if I didn't say I wasn't just a little disappointed. But I get it. You're loyal. Which is something that is scarce these days. Do you still want me to help with this thing we've been talking about? <laughs> you goddamn right I do! <laughs> and when it's all done, you all be more than square with me. You have my word. What do you really want to hear? That we kidnap and torture anyone suspected of working with the VC? I'm trying to ascertain the level of training that Lincoln Clay received during his time in Vietnam. Someone like that you don't need to train. You point them in the right direction and get the fuck out of their way. That's fair. I believe that. Are we all the way back here now? Keep looking, we'll find him. Goddamn thing. No sign here. 
Neither can they. Stay cool. We'll get through this. Motherfuckers. Uh, Intel view. Use Intel view to track enemies you've already seen. Intel view also reveals nearby weapon lockers, medicine cabinets, and object. Well, that's cheating, bro. As I said, that's cheating. We done? Oh, what the heck? Yeah, I'm here. What took you cat so long? Piece of shit drill kept overheating. You and Lincoln both still in one piece? Yeah, we good. Where's Danny? He's pushing everything off to the side so that we have room to catch the money. All right, well, once we squared away up here, we start driving. Look at all this money, by the way. Uh oh. Motherfuckers killed the lights. Just worry about the money. I'll deal with this. No chance. We slang in ammo, bro. We gonna be rich, Lincoln. Rich. They're trying to flush us out. Stay focused on what you're doing. <laughs> Freaking Georgie back there, dude. <laughs> bro, I already figured this stuff out. The fuck is coming for us? Ain't those the guards claiming to be from Baton Rouge? Need to get behind something. I know you did not think you were just about to walk up in here like that. the last box in God damn it those guards are cut us down the second we make a break for it tell Danny he needs to get us out of here and these bastards got us pinned down y'all need to figure something out I got some TNT I'll put on our side of the hole and detonate it what the fuck is that gonna accomplish with any luck it'll blow a hole big enough for y'all to drop down with any luck Danny do you even know what the fuck you're doing <laughs> Uh, back up, maybe. Uh oh, oh, the whole vault came down. Oh my god. We're good. Where'd my M60 go? No one really knows why Sal Marcano turned on Thomas Burke, uh, but he took Point Verdun from him and gave it to an enforcer named Roman the Butcher Barbieri, who promptly busted up one of Burke's legs. Good luck, Blazing. Burke was part of the heist crew. I mean, he was a gearhead, had never done anything like this before, but Thomas Burke insisted. He figured if the heist was a success, Sal would forgive him and return Point Verdun. Penetrator, all right. <laughs> hey, no, I heard there ain't nothing sweeter than Vietnamese pussy. <laughs> you tell me it's true. <laughs> Casanova Clay. Shit, man, it's so fucking good to see you. You too, Danny. That's Nikki. God, she wanted to be here, but I ain't remember how old. Oh, God damn, you piece of shit. Yeah, unfortunately. Come on, let's grab a beer. Wait for the old man to chill out, and then we can get down to it. Yeah. What's up, man? I already got it all set up and organized. All the girls gonna be there and everything, except we just gotta go in my cars because we can't roll up in that beat-up piece of shit outside. <laughs> oh, you didn't just call my all-American machine a beat-up? 
I'm just saying there better rides out there. Hey, bullshit there are. This car's a beast. I dropped the custom 358 in before we shipped out. That ain't the only thing you dropped in her. Maybe you should tell him about how you'd borrow it from Ellis and take the ladies for a ride. <laughs> Hell, man, leave me out of this. Did you fucking my car? Mm -hmm. Nah, it ain't no big deal. I was always wrapped up tight. <laughs> Besides, I already got one fucking bastard in my life. I don't need another one. All right, you know, you're going to clean it. Not just the back oh. seat. Every square inch. <laughs> I don't need to be riding around sitting in your shit. Hey, and you, funny man, you going to fucking help. Like hell I am, shit, I didn't get any. Yeah, well, it's just new. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, you fucking jokers got about as much chance of pulling this off as I do at winning a goddamn decathlon. Oh, all right, Dad, we hear you. Hey. Donnie and Ellis, you're gonna use the drills to cut a hole up through the bottom of the vault. You and Georgie, you'll be inside. You're gonna drop the money down, then get the hell out of there. That goddamn drill ain't easy to move, though. So we need a boat to get it through the canals and into position. Well, Ellis and I worry about the boat. See, George's old man flipped the guard at the reserve, giving you his truck. <laughs> <laughs> Between that and the uniforms, and no one gonna give us a second look. <laughs> Come on, let's get moving. We still gotta swing by Skeletta to finish up some prep work. Hey, and you two assholes, don't think this gets you off the hook when it comes to my car. Y'all best get ready to clean it. I ain't cleaning shit. Hey, you cleaning it. My father was a lot of things, few of them good. But he started out smuggling moonshine, so he knew about the canals underneath the city, and that one of them went right under the Federal Reserve. It was his idea to use a boat to move the drill into position. He was a real son of a bitch, my father. More than anyone else, I blame him for what happened. You want to stick your own neck out, fine. But leave your son out of it. It's his fault Danny died. Oh, spoiler. Is everyone in? We need to go. We all here, go! Holy! God's coming down through the hole. It's not going! Guys, we need to get the fuck out of here! Ow! Oh, I'm hit! Find another way out of here. This tunnel has to go somewhere. Oh, the the boat feels good. Well, I got a rear view mirror. What do I need to look behind me for? Uh, although it's not the greatest mirror in the world. The oh car. snap! Oh, there's go another on, one. Ah! I tried. I tried to thread it, bro. I did. It did not work. Oh, yeah, it did. Uh, it's just turning. I uh, am I dead? I'm dead. That's why it was just turning. Got it. It took me a second to realize. Note to self: Don't try to thread the needle. Is everyone in? We need to go. Yeet! Fuck, more guys. We need to get the fuck out of here. We getting out of here. First try. We'll find another way out of here. This tunnel has to go somewhere. It's the fucking cops. They open it fast. Oh, that went a lot smoother than last time. Oh, we were all going almost 90. No wonder we died on impact there. Oh, we squeezed them out, bro. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, ain't no way he's making that turn. I almost didn't make that turn. I saw it coming. This is spicy. I like this. Brian, punch it, Lincoln. Uh, I'm trying. Fuck, fuck. Oh, we're ramping it. Oh, that's so sick.
Everybody all right? That was the craziest fucking thing I've ever saw. <laughs> I'm glad we're breathing and all, but what the hell are we gonna do now? Our only option is to head up. Are you kidding me? There'll be cops all over the place. Well, at any luck, they'll be too busy dealing with Mardi Gras. Notice us. Let's go. Well, damn it, this ain't a gas. <laughs> Hey, you sure you need to grab that much of my ass? Oh, shut up and keep climbing, man. That leg is messed up. Howdy, Mustang. What's up, dude? Okay, give me a hand. All right. Come on. We got you. All right, once we get out there, I hit a payphone. Call through the ride. Can you walk? Yeah, somebody give me a hand. I can get one. Uh, it's probably just gonna be easier to carry a sorry ass. Hold up. Come here. Hey, hey! Don't put me the fuck down! If anybody asks, we say he's drunk. Y'all pick up that money. Let's go. Oh, God damn it. Oh, 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 that was awkward. A friend in Jesus. Oh, look at the titties, huh? huh? Hey, darling, you looking for a good time? Danny, keep it down. Oh, actually, you get a look at the titties? I mean, God damn. Oh, damn Danny, shut, shut up. up. You get us arrested. <laughs> Party time, baby. Oh, God. That guy's just... That's too funny, bro. This reminds me of, uh, Hitman. Hey, man. Get off the phone. Right fucking now. I insist that you apologize. I insist that you stop talking to us. Y'all keep an eye out. It's the big head guy again. Where's some deep shit? Bro, he's right help. there. Just off the parade route. Danny's hurt. I can't get a car to you because the roads are closed off. What are you? There's a grocery store on the back side of the cemetery. Can you get over there? Yeah. Grocery store back side of the cemetery. Waiting at Loden Dock. And Lincoln, be careful, yeah? You and Ellie Sport. We will. Hey, watch where you're going. Bro, I want to take a closer look at this guy. Sammy's having a car delivered. It'll be at the loading dock at the grocery store. God bless the old man. Let's go. I've, I've seen this guy like four times already. The dude with the big head. Okay. So we got to figure out how to get... Is it, why is the parade stopped? Or maybe it hasn't started yet. Or is it done? Maybe the parade's done. <laughs> that dude, uh, he had a time. There's a flower playing a guitar. Shut up. The police. Oh, do, do, look at those big heads. Fuck, they found the boat. Stay cool, man. We're still good. Well, I mean, it wouldn't be that hard to find that boat, to be fair. We didn't go very far. Oh, they're... Don't notice us. <laughs> okay, we're good. We made it. What the fuck are we gonna do? Ellis. Fucking pigs everywhere. Ellis, chill out. 
Everything's gonna be fine. All right, you guys take Danny and the money. Get to the car. I'll deal with the cops. I'll no. warn them off you. Hey, no fucking way, man. It's all right. He ain't going alone. We all got a friend. Jesus. Amen. All right. Let's go. Jesus. Oh. Oh, I can't go backwards. Uh, please pursue. Okay, yep. Heck me, dude. Hit the clown in the face, dude. Yes, I do. Something had my attention over there. Okay, we barely got out of that. No sign here. Let's check over there. He knew. We're in the cemetery now. VCB. All units, negative visual on suspect. Begin search in immediate vicinity. Where are they going? Let's try there. Perfect. Perfect. Gone on them, bro. Not even close. What's up, boys? Where's Georgie? We got separated before we lost sight of him. He said he'd meet us back at the house. Get in. Come on. Oh, God. Hit the ramp! Yeet! Come on, I'll make the turn. Responding units. Visual contact with suspect lost. Oh, we managed to get out of this. Oh, you dove oh, in the way. I don't care what it fucking costs. They go? How did they lose us that fast? I knew we could pull it up. I knew it. We're rich. Fuck. <laughs> Where, but where's Georgie at? Robbing people with a six gun. I fought the law. And the law can kiss my ass. We can go this way. <laughs> I fought the law and the law lost. <laughs> Easy dub. We got him, baby. How much is it? A little over two million dollars <laughs> per split. <laughs> <laughs> Holy mother God. Once everything's settled up, I'm calling the man I know, having him bring over three hookers. Boy, ain't All no right. hooker ever stepping foot in this house. You sure? Because two of them are for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be fucking in my new drifter. Well, I'd appreciate that. You know, my entire life, there's always been someone standing over me telling me. Where I could go, what I could do, who I could be seen with. This. What you boys did tonight. Yeah, Saint Denis this. and uh, this place are not very far apart in timeline either. This isn't just money. It's freedom. Real freedom. Ain't no one standing over me again. 
<laughs> over any of us. <laughs> Bourgeois c'est pouvoir, hein? Bourgeois <laughs> c'est pouvoir! <laughs> Well, well, well. Oh, look Man at himself. Look at the oh, and look at what I've dug up. You mind pouring one more of those? Holy <laughs> shit. It would be my pleasure. Because he told me ship went sideways during the robbery. Lincoln had to save your ass. You should be damn proud of that, boy. I am, Sal. More than you'll ever know. <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, that is some down-home hooch right there, isn't it? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Listen, I got a guy outside. Y'all mind if he comes in and packs up my cut? Not at all. Look at that. Let's see if you can handle this down-home hooch. Yeah, let's give me some of that. Trying to get some corn whiskey? Make you a man. <laughs> they all the same. <laughs> hey, take the one on the end. It's your cut. Plus what I owe you. Even put in a little extra for your trouble. Couldn't have pulled it off without you, Sammy. Y'all done right by me tonight. Mwah. Mwah. Why don't you get us something off the top shelf? We need to celebrate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ain't got to tell me, <laughs> yeah. twice. Damn, fill me up. All right, you know we'll something, Lincoln? You. You're possibly the baddest motherfucker I ever laid my eyes on. You shouldn't have said no. <laughs> Where the fuck you think you're going? Fucking niggas. Go on, grab that bag. Let's go. When I got the Sammy's, the whole place was burning. I still don't know what brought me there that night. Luck? Divine Providence? Or something else? Pulling Lincoln out of the fire, he woke up long enough to tell me to call John Donovan. So that's what I did. Most days I wish I'd never made that call. Mr. Donovan, do you know this individual? Sure. Sal Marcano. Mm -hmm. And how about this man? That's Sal's worthless piece of shit, brother Lou. Look. Enough with the dog and pony bullshit. What's your real question? Did you help Lincoln Clay murder Sal Marcano and all prominent members of his crime family? You're goddamn right I did. I see the moon I see trouble on the way. I see So those the men you're gonna kill, huh? That's the plan, Padre. It's a dangerous course you're contemplating. And what do you think we should do? Sal Marcano deserves to die. I won't argue otherwise. Kill him. But let that be the end of it. That's not enough! It's enough if you say it's enough. I know what Sal did to you, Lincoln. 
but nothing you do will bring any of them back. This isn't about bringing them back or even exacting some street justice. It's about making that bastard feel what it's like to lose everything. Watch as I take it all away from him. This is a one-way road, Lincoln. And once you start down it, there ain't no turning back. I'm going to Sammy's to get my stuff. You ready? I'll be waiting in the car. Taught us kids to turn the other cheek. Not fight back. Problem is that don't work. Not in the real world. Seem too keen on the plan. No. Nope. Need to worry about him. I just hate to encounter any of that Catholic guilt I'm always hearing about. He knows every low life thing I've ever done and has never ratted me out. If I say we can trust him, we can trust him. Fair enough. So you mind telling me what we're really doing? I'm gonna kill Marcado and all the assholes who work for him. Bullshit. If that's all you're after, you'd grab an XM21, smear on some face paint, and they'd all be dead before dinner. And you sure as hell wouldn't need a tack up center and all this other shit you've asked me for. After I got back, Marcano offered me the hollow, said it was time for Sammy to retire. I told him no. So you think what happened is your fault? Hard to see it otherwise. What do you think Sal was going to do? Host a little party for Sammy? Maybe give him a gold watch and a plaque congratulating him on his retirement? We both know there's only one way out of the life. And you still haven't answered my question. I'm gonna take over the city, district by district. Marcano wanted me to run the hollow? Fuck him. By the time I'm done, I'll be running the whole goddamn city. <laughs> that's exactly what I wanted to hear. Assuming, of course, you're up for something that strenuous. How the fuck wouldn't I be? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you got shot in the face? I might have lost a step or two, but it'll come back to me. Always does. God, if that isn't the fucking truth. One other thing. Probably not much of a surprise, but most of the cops in this town are in Sal's pocket. Gonna yeah. always assume that. Just being diligent. The cops see you fighting Sal's goons. They're coming after you every time. Yeah, it's basically just like the the beginning of like, what what, what would that be? The uh, the epilogue. Ugh! You sure you don't need a ride? Nah, man, I'm good. I'll be at the motel. Come see me when you're ready. Can I just walk through the door? Nope. Yeet! Good thing we went to the basement, huh? Dang, dude. This is where it happened. Welcome home, son.
Oh, true, you're right. Epilogue comes after, it would be the prologue. Gotta do. Uh, I ever tell you how I got this? Sure, you stole it. That idea. Yeah. The pocket of this old white man used to come around here raising him. Take this with you. It's always brought me good luck. I can't do that. I know you think you're alone in this world, you go. No, but you're not. And you never will. Mm -hmm. My man looked like straight out the military. I mean, w w which he relatively is, you know. <sighs> My man looking spicy. Use your combat knife to perform lethal takedowns on enemies. You can also select non-lethal takedowns in the option menu under game. So is it on by default? Because we about to go out there killing everybody, bro. We about to go after everybody. Stash house. When you're out in the field, any money you collect will be stored in your wallet. If you kill an action, you'll lose a sizable portion. Uh, and then restore it, okay? So I got 1200 on me, so do I just You eat it in there? Done. Clapped. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I want to click on that, I'll be honest. What is this? Uh, I don't think I want to click on that one either. <laughs> so we got outfits now. Uh, form wait. Full. We can go full metal on them. What the heck? What is that? Formal, Mr. Clay, business hours, fresh. Eh. Oh, bro, does that not look like, um, oh, what's his name from, uh, the GTA 5 story, bro? Nice mustache. That's a good one, too. Oh, that one's a really good one, too. Oh, my God. What in the Freddie Mercury is this? Mafia 2? Ooh. Are we about to kick it old school? We're about to kick it old school. Oh, so is it is it okay to like interact with that stuff then I can actually collect collectibles screw it I know uh, I know mafia 2 was a little uh, little rough with the uh, the collectibles All right. Get me out of here Uh, so now we gotta talk to Donovan about what it is that we're gonna, you know, be doing. How we start taking over the city. Exacting revenge. And making sure that it doesn't happen to anybody else. Nice, they crashed. Sick, bro. <laughs> you 
were lying about setting up a tax center. The key to running a successful black bag operation is plausible deniability. This is why I stole all this shit from the FBI. <laughs> Things go tits up, those chicken dicks can deal with the fallout. Glad to see you haven't lost your touch. <laughs> if there's one thing I'm good at, it's fucking with Hoover's Ferry Brigade. And while you were convalescing, I did some digging around. Wanted to see if there are any local assets for you to recruit. I came up with three possibilities. Right now, my priority is getting the hollow out from whoever ended up with it. Figured as much. Haitians? Well, I thought they fell apart after I put Baca down. Lucky for us, they're back up. And they're none too pleased that Sal gave Delray Hollow to the Dixie Mafia. Dixie Mafia? Georgie's idea. He's got him running heroin, trying to get everybody hooked. Motherfucker. Now, I'll be damned if I let those coon asses destroy everything that Sammy built up. Who replaced Baca? Unknown. He managed to keep his identity a secret. Unknown? Even to John Donovan? Never thought I'd see the day. Well, I can't help it if I was born pigmentally challenged. So, you telling me my only option is to tail one of these Haitians? Hope he leads me back to the mysterious leader? Hey, it's better than no options. And once you've ingratiated yourself with them, you come see me. I'm finishing something up you're gonna want to see. I like how he said, pigmentally challenged. <laughs> that was a good little touch. Story mission. Old times sake. Is it marking all of these for me already? It is. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was really an accident, wasn't it? All these icons mean. Where can I park? We're just gonna park right, uh, right here. And now we wait. Flying James L. Ray back this week. Oh, no cutscene? It amazes me. They okay. expect us to believe it was my, one man my, my, who did end up the game. It's too easy. Too bad. Let's say he was the one who shot Dr. King. Just him and no one else. What if it's really that easy to strike down a great man like Wait, how'd my car King? get over there? Kennedy. Brother Malcolm. Then nothing in this country will ever change. Yeah, you struggle and you sweat and someone can take it all away just like that. <coughs> I didn't get to the button in time that time. That one snuck up on me. Looking good, chocolate pudding. Maybe you can give me a taste later on. <laughs> Move along. It's about to get violent real quick. Informants work, uh, the criminal ranks around New Bordeaux, uh, and take it down. Okay. So take a, uh, isolate him through combat or stalking, then approach him to start the interrogation sequence. Oh. I thought the other guy was the one that, uh, I was supposed to interrogate. Oh, do I just hold it? We all want Dixie out of the hollow. Give me your boss and I'll make it happen. Fuck. Shit. Get to the voodoo shop. You'll find the boss there. Sorry about the headache, brother. Just to make sure. Uh, shotgun? I know he had one. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is.
Who do you voodoo? Sam B. Yoink, don't mind if I do. What is that? Electronic part? These might soon be useful. Okay. Excuse me. Oh, sick! Move! Okay, I'll just keep backing you up. Nailed it. Dang, that really hurt, too. We weren't even going that fast. Ah! Unless I was already below half health and I didn't notice. How's the volume, by the way? Is it okay? We still all right with the uh, the audio? Find a way inside. Well, I have a uh, the master key, so. I'm just saying. Oh, I was literally just gonna shoot the door open. Wait. There we go. Knock, knock. That's out front. Nobody here. Wait. Doing a lot of waiting right now. Of course, I mean, that's what you got to do when you want to exact revenge, you know? Coffee? Nice trick you pulled back at the Haitian camp. Ten Baca was holding you prisoner. And I yelled, you are dead. It appears we both full of surprises. Certainly does. <laughs> What can I do for you, Lincoln Clay? I want you to help me kill Sal Marcano. I see. A few months ago, you was trying to kill me. Now you break in here and expect me to trust you? Now that Marcano's back in the Dixie Mafia, it's only a matter of time till they come for you. And when they do, they'll kill everyone standing in their way. Lest I hitch my horse to your wagon, so to speak. I'll see to it that you get the hollow. After that, depends on how things shake out. Do you know why Sammy and I were at war? On account of you going after the lottery? Please. Just because you don't want to face some uncomfortable truths ain't a reason to act naive. Sammy and I were fighting because the people in Dahala deserve better than a two-faced old man who handed out cans of food whenever the mood hit him. Who always did what Sal Marcana told him to do, even if it pitted him against his own people. He did the best he could. And yet his best didn't amount to much, did it? I don't like her. Once I have to holler, I run it as I see fit. No questions asked. As long as you give me access to your muscle, your connections, and a place to hold up from time to time, you can do what you want. No eyelash having. Marcana replaced Sammy with a man named Richie Doucette. Do you know of him? Assume he's Dixie Mafia. He's a wooster. Likes to kidnap black teenagers and take them out to the bayou. After starving them for a few days, he cuts them loose, tells them to run. Sometimes he brings out the dogs. You know, for old time's sake. That's how he killed my sister. This is all I have left. How do I 
of fun. It's still dangerous around here for him, so he stays on the move. But his men operate out of the community church in the old theater, Pearl, as it used to be called. It was named after Sammy's wife. I'm taking it down first. One of my men have been staking it out. Seeing what he can learn about how it's being run, you should talk to him and see what he knows. Once I deal with it, I'll see about the church. Chat, how we feeling about her? Let me see what you got. Jackie. What the hell? Uh we've gained access to her associate, the arms dealer. As you uh, increase earn for your underbosses, they will give you access to their associates and upgrades to their services. The basic arms dealer has a mobile weapons and equipment store. You can view future upgrades and items for the arms dealer in the assets menu under associates and upgrades. Okay. Why are you driving around in a truck? What happened to your store? Government shut me down. They don't want niggas buying guns. Where are we going to start shooting the hell out of white folks or some such? Motherfuckers. Tell me about it. Let me know if you see something you want. Okay. Uh, upgrades for Lincoln? Oh, okay. Firearms and upgrades? Okay, so what kind of money we got here? So in the safe, we got 1,200 and we got 600 on us. Handguns? What do, what do we got? Equip for free? I ha I have a suppressed pistol? I have this one as well? Oh my god. Dude, some of these are fire. Apparently I already have some special stuff. I've got this. And I have this. Which is a suppressed 1911. Uh, what about... Okay, so we have this. One-handed? I have three different shotguns I can choose from already. My god. Oh, automatic weapons? Jesus. Oh my god. Special weapons? Oh, imagine. Equipment. A screaming what? Proximity mines, I can buy those. Vehicle modifications, okay, can't do any of that. Uh, attack vest. Oh, that's what we saw on the minimap before. It's always the revolver. Should I rock the revolver? The revolver and the shoddy? Oh, this is a... Oh, we gotta rock this shoddy, bro. Oh. Okay, so so the, I didn't realize that was a secondary. Okay, uh, rifles. This one. Oh my god, they look so nice. Okay, anyway. So we've got multiple objectives. Okay, maybe we don't have multiple objectives. What is this? Oh, it's the father. Okay, so how many sections are there? There's the bayou, two, three. 
four, five. Oh my god, there's a lot. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then there's this over here. Uh, where's the car? Here it is. Oh. Oh, I need to check that one thing. Options. Uh, it said under game, right? Crazy? Yeah, that. Away we go. We got another objective to do. What happened to our old car? Wait, there's something over here. What is this? This. What is this? What is that? It's in the bottom there. On my HUD. Knock, knock. How do I... Here? Oh, Lincoln, what's up? You were sight for so eyes. Laveau, been a while. Wasn't expecting to see you working with the Haitians. It's either this or bow down to them fucking coon asses. And you know I ain't ever been one to bow down to anyone. <laughs> ain't that the guy? He looks like truth. the bomb guy from Metal Sign Gear 2. Say, Metal Gear Solid 2, sorry. Asshole named Merle Jackson runs it. Turned it into a brothel. That's white fellas come in and do whatever they want to our young sisters. How do I get to them? You don't. Not yet, anyway. A lot of those Dixie fucks try to stay out of sight. There's someone put a bullet up their ass. If I hit his operations, he'll have to come out and deal with me. I got an idea how to get his attention. He got some girls locked up on the second floor of Perlis. Calls them his thoroughbreds. Has them strung out on all kind of shit. He makes a lot of money off them. Go in there quiet. Get them out of there. I'll let you know when it's done. Hey, uh, I'm sorry to hear about Sammy Nellis. They always did right by me. We're going to do right by them. Uh, okay. So, basically, we do enough, and then we get the boss to come out, and that's how we take him out. Got it. Gotta free the girls being held. I can take a boat right across the street if I really wanted to. No traction. There we go. We about to cause a ruckus. Ah! All part of the plan. It's good. We're okay. I do have a gun. Hey. Just walk in with a gun. Zero care in the world. Mr. Laveau told me you'd be coming. The girls are upstairs. Be careful. Merle's people are all over the place. Okay. I will. Thanks. Slow mo shooting. Uh, when the meter is full, hold the mouse right and press space. Make headshots to extend the meter. We might have to go to uh, the old uh, handgun. So aim and hold space. All right, we got a new collectible. Is there a way to walk? Oh, I don't want to do that. 
Uh, there we go. Okay, I can't get upstairs that way. We gotta find a way upstairs. Yeah, I'm about to just start blasting. This way? I don't know what is hostile area or not. Can I just yoink the money? Yoink? Oh, I just stole money from the business. I know, as soon as we walk backstage, we're screwed. The guy up there. A yoink? Money in my pocket. Okay, so we can't go that way. <laughs> I mean, do you see where you're at? That was, that was... Bro, Intel views cheating. Oh. Oh. Toast. Oh. Everybody get. Oh. oh, it's go time. Easy clap. Take a walk. All of you. Uh go six guys hanging there. We were home real soon. He better watch where he points that thing. He's gonna shoot somebody. Yep. Nope. I'm staying away. I'm gonna stay out of it. Our father, who are in heaven. That's interesting. Wait, where is this? What is this? Oh! Heck yeah, dude! That's a good clip. I forgot you was born and raised here, too. Huh? You're out. He ain't gonna know what hit him! It's go time. I'll be honest, this feels more like Lincoln Clay, you know, literally just walking in. Oh, you think you're slick, don't you? Give me the word. Run that motherfucker out of here. Floored. The whole stealth approach? Nah. But this guy's got no idea I'm right here. Homie had zero clue. Okay, we'll come back to these rooms in a second. What? What?
I want to try to kick the door down. That didn't work though. Those doors are locked. I want to kick the doors down, bro. What's this? A shotgun? Brother, brother, calm down. You have to use a lighter touch is all. Well, what am I supposed to do? Fucking animal acts like I... No chance. What kind of money is that? Okay, that's good amount of money. We like that. Alright. Go back to these rooms that are locked back here. Stealth is overrated. It doesn't feel like Lincoln, bro. It just doesn't. You guys know how I play these games. If it feels like the character, I'll do it. Stealth, Lincoln? Nah. Lincoln's here for one reason. And we all know what that reason is. You killed him. Don't try run Gene Okay. You should kill all of them. Every last one. Get out of here. Now. Next. Spread the word. Any woman needing help should go to the pierced heart. Thank thank you. One more. There it is. Like we don't want it time, but it's my family again. Get out of here. Go see Cassandra at the pierced heart. She'll help you. No cap. Uh, game's a little easy so far, difficulty wise. Of course, we haven't seen nothing too crazy yet. We'll have to see. We might have to crank the difficulty up. We don't want it to be too easy, you know? But we don't want it to be too hard that it takes away from the story. My turn on the stage, baby. Okay, I gotta... Can I do all the damage in one location? Is that how that works? Can't open that door. The demonstration is on Friday. I think that's all I can do here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch out. We're gonna go primary. We're gonna go shoddy. Right, and then secondary, we're gonna we want some sort of handgun. We did talk about the revolver earlier, so we might just do, we might just do the revolver, just because revolvers are sick. Right? Oh. Destroy the- oh, you think destroying the alcohol? You think that'll do something? Uh, we do have Molotovs. Let's toss a Molotov or two in here before we leave. That's a good idea. Yay! Do you hear that? There's somebody here still. Hear somebody. There's somebody still here. This trunk's open. What is there anything in here? No. What? What is happening right now? It's out here.
This dude was just unloading. Back my two. He had a gun. I wasn't messing around. Okay. He's got a gun. He's got a gun. Yes, ma'am, I do. And it's got a purpose. And its purpose is not for you. Bar. Well, if he bought it, then he can afford it. I'm just I'm just saying. We didn't go this way. This way was locked before. I don't think there's anything else that we can really do here. Uh, we didn't go in here, but there's nothing in here. We're just, you know, making sure we don't, we're not missing nothing. Let's blow this popsicle stand. They got the red lights on, I just noticed. Bro, she's still talking about that air conditioner. Let's go talk to Donovan. Yeah, yeah. What are you standing in the road for, you lunatic? Those are red dots over there. Okay, you just gonna stop in the intersection? You ain't just gonna keep going? Deserved. Who needs to park? Hi, Donovan. What more can we do, brother? Hey, Donnie. I got a little something for you. You've been running around so much out there, I figured I'd make your life a little easier. You can use this to call on your support. And here I was thinking you were a heartless asshole. Mm, Jerry's still out on that one. How could you be so heartless? Okay, so we gotta go back now. So our objective is still there. So he gave he, so he gave us a portable radio, but how do we use it? Uh, I have to wait for arms dealer to show up. Tab. Hold tab. So this is how we can switch between stuff, and then that's to call the arms dealer. Okay. I'm confused though. Was I supposed to do something specific back there? Were we onto something and I just didn't? Maybe it wouldn't let us do what we were supposed to do. I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now. We're gonna talk to the secret weapon. What's up? I'm back. You were sad for so yeah, 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 yeah. Women. God damn, if that place in the hellhole. Pains you to see what those redneck fucks are doing, doesn't it? Soon as I get my hands on Jackson, that all comes to an end. Merle's got pimps scattered around the hollow. Is leaning on them to make up for what he's lost. Kill them, and he'll show up at the club. All right. When you're dealt with them, come back. I'll be able to confirm that Merle's over at the club. There we go. Uh, you now have multiple objectives available. Select objectives from the map or in the objective panel. All right. Okay. So money reward on that. Money reward on that. 
Well, this one's closer. I think it's the same thing. No, they're not. Okay. Okay, so it highlights both of them. Oh. Well, we're driving this now. See you, old blue. This wasn't far at all. Excuse me. Oh my god, this shotgun. We're not gonna talk about how I missed the dude and hit her. We're not gonna talk about that. I literally clicked. Bring it. I got money for all, or money, lol, I do have money, uh, but I got, I got ammo for all of you. Yeah, see, th this feels more like Lincoln style. Walk in, blast them, leave. My bad, bro. <laughs> His car's back. <laughs> that took me less than five minutes to do. You watching your back out there? Yeah, we taking care of uh, everybody. Continuing to cause any remaining, uh, yeah, we're done. Merle's hold up over at Perlis. What I hear, he's pissed as all hell. <laughs> Wish I could see that asshole's face right about now. Just so we're on the same page. Once I'm in there, I'm killing any motherfucker who gets in my way. Ain't no one shedding tears for those pricks. You do what you think's best. I'll be seeing you, Lebeau. Alright, it's time to get good old Merle. That's so funny, bro. I stole his car. I commit a heinous crime. I show back up in his car, and his car is back. That pump shotgun that I'm using, though, that's meaty. Oh, he, oh, we're back here. Oh, yeah, you already told us about that. What if I don't want to call him? I don't, I, like. Now, there ain't no trying to find nobody. Out the way. It's weird that the primary is two and the secondary is one. It's backwards. Can 
Can I go this way this time or no? No, I cannot. You hide now. Huh? Gotta find him. Still here. Find him. Don't get burned. Looking over here now. Oh my. You got him over here. Oh. There you go, cocksuckers. Try that again. Oh. This revolver, bro. Well, don't let him shoot at us. Get down low. Yeah, you tried. Spread out. Don't get burned. Little rat. Oh fuck. He fell off. Oh. I'm pinned, you asshole. Brutal takedown. Uh, when you want to take out an enemy and briefly stun all these nearby enemies, use a brutal takedown. Hold F and release in the highlighted window. I'm empty. In my ass down. Gotta be smart about our movement. Done. You're done. My guy pre firing. Shouldn't come here. Yeah, we'll see about that. I'm coming. Oh, he's running around the other way. I'm coming for you. What was that? Look at this, look at this guy. <laughs> what was he doing? Is he back here in that office again? Heard he not only got the girls, he killed Doc too. Yeah, he was deader than shit. Fuck. Doc gets off. The boy's out there running those four- I got him! Ugh. He ate that first one. Alright, neutralize racket boss, take over a racket, then call it underboss to send over their people to help secure it. Kill Merle Jackson to break the prostitution racket. Yeah, you bet that you bet to know the answer to that question. He's got me pinned. You're done. You're done. Well, what you gonna do, nigger? This. Rightfully so. That man was just evil through and through. Alright, uh, so whatever those dolls are, we've got those now. I'm, I'm assuming it's some sort of distraction thing. I guess I have to assign it to her. I ain't got anybody else, so. Dixie motherfuckers are out of pearlers. Have your men come lock it down. Motherfuckers out of the church, and Richie will have to respond. Game's rough. A 
Are these the new boys? I hate getting wet like this. <laughs> True. In uh, 1966, the FBI recruited me out of college. Uh, Chicago was my first assignment, but I was transferred down south in 68. I stayed there until 86, uh, when I was promoted to uh, assistant director of the criminal enterprise branch. I stayed with the Bureau until my retirement in 1999. There are so many stories about Cassandra. Um, as a girl, she was kidnapped, killed, and brought back to life by a voodoo priest. She watched swamp rats rape and murder her sister. She shot her own father and dumped his body in the swamps. It's impossible to know what's true. Uh, trying groups of enemies to its location. Okay. Yeah, so it's just a noisemaker. You gosh darn right your fault. But look at all the money just laying around. The heck? Yeah, I'm gonna pick it up. I got a clothing locker here. Put on Lincoln's default stuff. His original attire. Alright, give me this armor. We did we didn't lose our armor during that whole exchange. There was the one shotgun blast that hit us, and it was like, oh god. Okay, anyway. Now we gotta go back to Donovan. So now they've introduced us to, uh, I guess, a method of taking down main like key points in areas so now we know that we can do that i guess we just gotta unlock that stuff now I... we're always waiting Always making us wait, man. Surprised to see you out here. <laughs> Decided to get some fresh air. That heroin the Dixie Mafia's been selling? It's run out of there by a man named Charlie Kincaid. Meaning all the other dealers around here kick up to him. Charlie stays away if he can help it, so you're gonna have to put the squeeze on him. I flagged a couple of his guys. You get them to talk, they'll tell you how to get to him. Now, from what I hear, Charlie's only in this for the money. He's not a true believer like those other Dixie Mafia assholes. So maybe if I talk sweet to him, he'll decide to bail on Doucette and come work for me. Assuming I can draw him out. I got something I can help you with that. That's what I wanted to show you. New Bordeaux is on a standard communication grid. So getting a system of wiretaps up and running should be fairly easy. Just install this little beauty on a junction box, and I'll be able to construct an intelligence map of the nearby area. How many more of these you got? Just those. The parts are on an agency watch list. Man, to dig up more of them, we could wiretap the entire city. All right. God damn it! People think living under these commie motherfuckers is so great they should move their asses over to Moscow. When you find more of these, you bring them to me. You are way too sensitive about that shit, man. Oh, fuck those motherfuckers. Fucking traitors. I'll see you when it's time to move against Charlie. Oh, no. <laughs> So is that what those little things that we were talking about before are? Uh, helps Donovan mark targets and opportunities. Yeah, all right. Oh, 
Open says me. Slap that bad boy in there. Okay. Collect fuses. All right. So. Are we going into the church, though? Sorry, God. Uh, use view and telescope at enemies. Punch. It's cheating. Hey, yoink. We're already in third person, man. I'm just, I'm just saying. This guy don't even know what's about to happen. that wish put on Bobby that boy was weak-minded you are too if you believe in that voodoo nonsense well they say he couldn't get it up that who do you voodoo mother suckers oh this guy's done for I laid that guy out Bet. Oh. Can't keep losing guys like this. Need to grab this car. He killed another one. Oh. Fresh out. That could have been really bad. Oh, that miss. Wow, are you done? I didn't do it, man. Go, go, go. Gonna barbecue your ass. Please. Just... Dang. I tried to hit him before he got it off. Open it up. We don't need to use that yet, though. Where did you come from, brother? Run that motherfucker out of here. I hit him good. Yeah. Oh heck. Nope. Move. We're going in. Jesus. This shotgun is insane. Okay, so you don't have to pick up the money that the guys drop, but the on-site money you do have to manually pick up. Weird. It's in here. Okay, don't want that though. Another poster.
More money. We like it. I think we're pretty clear here. Job well done. Oh, we're gonna be rich. All right, while we're here, I guess we can replenish our armor. Took a couple of doozy shots there. Can I get through here? Thank you. Well, you know it's gonna be bad when you walk up to a location, you just see waist high cover everywhere. Clear out back here before we move on. Oh, money, money. What are you all doing? You not part of this? Lucky. All right, let's bounce. Let's see what we got next. Oh, I want up here. Oh my God. There's so many different approaches to this bad boy. Why would you not just want to walk in guns blazing though? It hits a different type of way in this game. Most games I'm down for that stealth approach. This one, it just, Lincoln man, it just feels right to just walk in and be like, what's up, big PP swanging. This hits different. Okay, going over here. Oh. I'm gonna hit you. I warned him. I said I was gonna. And I did it. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know, we know, we know, we know. Fuck that. Never in a million years is a white man. Looks like. Uh, 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 pull that motherfucker out of here. I don't want to die here. Do it. Let's get the timing. Slick. Slick. Your turn now. What's four finger got going on at the church? There's all kinds of dope over at the church. If you destroy it, the boss is going to lose a lot of money. <laughs> you know too fucking much. Listen, I think the the rational thinking method is is out the door. You know, it's just out the window, and the door. I'm just saying, if if. These guys are willing to rat out and turn on each other that fast, you know, and, and they actually know each other. If I recruit them, like, they're just gonna do it to me. They don't know me. I just cleared this place out. I literally did just walk in here and clear this place out. <laughs> That's okay. Huh? 
Oh my god. Move. Move out the way. Move. What are you doing? Go. Get out of here. She just stands there. Let's not talk about what I'm hiding behind right now, okay? I know he's one of them. Is that it? I thought these were gonna be like, I don't know, explosive. Doesn't seem like that much. I feel like this would be worth a lot more. Oh god shit, motherfucker. Who did this? Yes, we learned it. Ain't that right, boy? Me. Oh. oh my god. Who did this? Wow! Oh, it's a stoplight over there. Dude, there was something on the left that was just... I don't know. It was weird. It's like, what is that? Just a stoplight. I think we're done here. That went fairly well. I like the idea this game doesn't give you a lot of reserve ammo for your weapons. So it, it gives you the opportunity to uh, switch your loadout just on the fly. This not my car. Mine's over here. I like that. What is wrong with you? There it is. I was like, when did my yellow car turn into a yellow truck? Got some bad man to go take care of. Oh god, I couldn't turn. Go oh, up. Oh. Turning in the rain's rough. Move. Where are you going? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come here. Get out. You and me are going for a little ride. You out of your goddamn mind? You're gonna tell me about the dope operation. You done it now, brother. That was too goddamn close. You don't intimidate me. Tell me what I need to know. I gotta get onto like a main thoroughfare. Freak him out real quick. There's a fucking car there. You don't intimidate me. Yeah, we'll Still, see about that. Go. There's a fucking car there. I ain't dying for you, asshole. You trying to piss me off? Slow down. Slow down. I actually lost Slow control. Give it up, cocksucker! I didn't need forces dealing around the hall. 
things. Oh my god. That dude is done for. There's no maybe about that. <laughs> Oh, I'm starting to learn how to drive. Look at all the police. Dude, look at all of the police. What if I just roll up? I ain't done nothing wrong. Look at them all. Hey. I ain't doing nothing wrong. I'm just curious if I could walk past hey, them all. Where you at? How you doing? Where you think y'all going? I have no idea where my car is at, by the way. Not that I need to know where it's at. We've just had it for a little bit now, you know? Got a little attached, man. Alright, can't vault that wall. Alright, we're gonna circle all the way around. Just because I wanted to mess with the police. Uh, neutralize them before they reach the nearest phone. Yeah, pff, I don't care about that. I'll be honest. I. The last time I'm doing this, swear on my mother. Huh? Oh snap! I still got some living to do. Now you tried to burn me. You call that hiding? You call that dying? Weak. I can't. Oh, there we go. I tried to figure out a way in. Dude, we're gonna have to drop off all this money. Look at all this money we got sitting on us. That armor's doing us some good, though, I'll tell you what. Uh, take a breath to stay cool. Oh, apparently they're scared of Georgie. What's in here? Oh my god, I was already on the spot. They call me Johnny on the spot. Okay. I don't, where am I? What is this? Okay. Oh, I could have just walked in on the left over there. We're back. We stole a Dixie truck. That's about it. That was weird. This thing handles a lot better. I'm driving one of their own vehicles. They're losing their mind over nothing. I lost my yellow vehicle, man. Alright, we gotta do some waiting again. Yeah, no, we're, we're done. We're good. I've been listening in on old Charlie. And he isn't such a bad fellow. He's more of a kinder, gentler redneck. And as luck would have it, his wife is expecting. Man in that situation usually doesn't care who he works for. As long as he's still above ground. Poor sap starts blubbering when the two of them talk about names. He just walk in front of the scene. Like, what the heck? And Thomas Lee. 
Anyway, his guys have the church locked down, and all of them are more of the shoot first, let God sort them out variety of redneck. You get your hands on Charlie, though. He'll do what he's told without putting up much of a fuss. All your intel's been updated. You going back to the motel? After I get something to eat, I'll see you when you're done dealing with these inbred assholes. Deal. Oh my god. Are there more? Uh, his enforcer killed them to loosen boss control. Uh, remaining in I was reading that. Uh, because you've done this, you now have the option to kill the racket boss or some quick cash or recruit them to improve earn in the long run. No, we we done all of them. Shotgun in hand. Do we start outside or we start inside? Oh, right here. What's up, brother? That dude kind of... He got it rough. Bro, this is the third time we're going to have to clear this place out. wrong stop that gonna beat this guy oh imagine seeing that in the doorway I thought it was somebody else shooting I saw you over there there's a guy over there He's got the pin. I hit him Where's that other guy? I saw him over there. He was in that doorway. Come here! Done for. Your time's up. Shit. Shit. Fucking Richie. I didn't want to do this shit. Can't trust a rat. That's what I was saying earlier. That's exactly what I was saying earlier. Bunch of rats, man. How, how can you trust them? Improved accuracy. Gunsmith. Okay, okay. We can get that now. We've earned enough. Send your men to the First Baptist Church. Those Dixie heathens have been handled. I'll have some of my men come right over. And thanks. I wonder if we're going to end up turning on her, too. Here come the squad. The whole squad. Oh my god, they ran that guy over. Oh, Jesus! Two of those guys are not uh, a part of them. your name for the record? Donovan. John. Mr. Donovan, you understand that by appearing before this committee, you have explicitly waived your constitutional rights in regards to counsel and self-incrimination. Sure. And you further acknowledge that by appearing before this committee, you agree 
to disclose all information pertaining to the events that occurred in New Bordeaux during the summer and fall of 1968. <laughs> I wouldn't be sitting here if I didn't. You were an operative in the Central Intelligence Agency from 1953 to 1969, is that correct? That's right. When did you arrive in Vietnam? August of 1961. Please describe for this committee the actions you took during your time in Vietnam. I spent a couple months in Saigon, and then I was transferred to a base in Laos that was operated by the Special Activities Division. We trained and equipped the Hmong and then turned them loose on the NVA. We're running arms and supplies via the Ho Chi Minh Trail. And you worked with Lincoln Clay in what eventually became the Phoenix Program. Within a year or so, Lincoln was heading up his own PRU. We'd cross over into Vietnam and locate enemy targets and either kill them or bring them back for interrogation. <laughs> Just thinking about it? Jesus Christ. You wouldn't believe the shit we did to those cocksuckers. What? What? Dude, they were yelling and screaming. I thought those were some baddies. The heck? Alright, we good here? We done? Good? Moving on? God ain't forgetting what those motherfuckers did to this place, Mr. Clay. I won't either. Uh, let me, let me get some armor. Just suit it up, ready to roll back out there, baby. Yoink. We're taking this bad boy. It's mine now. Excuse me. Now we go. Alright, now we're back out talking to the lady of the hour. I don't want to drive that Dixie truck around. We gotta look out for those wiretap uh, locations. How you gonna slow down in an intersection? Nice. Put the brakes on. You ain't supposed to stop that far away from the car in front of you. His name is Jesse. We were just having ourselves a little conversation about which he do say. Listen, I ain't done nothing, you hear? I don't know anything. I, I was just taking a walk and walking down the street and, and she scrammed me is all. You with Dixie Mafia? No. Yes. I mean, shit. I did it for the money, you hear? I, I ain't got nothing personal against y'all. I don't even carry a gun. Where's Doucette? He's... He's out at the abandoned amusement park to the west of here. Banned Saturdays? What the hell is he doing out there? From what I heard, it's because you've been tearing things up. And Georgie, Georgie's on a goddamn warpath. He wants Richie dead. So Richie, he grabbed what was left of the heroin and took off. Said he was gonna lay low until he could settle things with Georgie. How many men he got with him? Hell, I don't know. All of them. Hand me that knife. No, no, please. No, I ain't done nothing to y'all. Please, I, I'm begging you. My mom, my mom, mom she's... Go on, get. He could warn Doucette. He ain't no threat to nobody. Let him run back home to his mama. If you wrong, there'll be hell to pay. You know? <sighs> okay. This is how you're glad for Morgano by uncovering and seizing control of his current. Yep. I think from. Yep. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. After taking down. Mm hmm. Yo. Mm hmm. Yep. It's time. It's time. This would be a good, like, climax to part one. Be taking out. 
one of the first like under bosses. Oh, hold on. We we gotta get a fit for this. Hold on, before we're done. Uh. Hmm. We could go straight on uh, full metal with this, but I'm thinking. I was thinking this one. It's about to get real. It's already been kind of amplifying a little bit, but now. It's gonna be savage. Oh. That corner didn't even need a street light anyway. Or a stop light. Dang, we didn't have to go far. There we go. Oh my god, this place is flooded. What was that? Wow, it's really flooded here. Alright, looks like we can't go through the front. Who needs to take the ladder when you just jump it? Wait, how do I use the ladder? There we go. What? I'm got a bad sense about this man. Richie needs to work his shit out with Georgie. Well, he ain't got no fucking choice. Things hey, just keep up. Up. Welcome to Baron Saturday's Fun Park. We're sure happy to have you with us today. So put your troubles aside and enjoy yourself. <laughs> you never know what that dirty old Baron's got waiting for you. Oh yeah, I believe it. Alright, you're done. Did he really just try to throw a Molotov into this? He's hurting. Yeah, we'll see how that works out for you. Yeah, you gosh darn right. Oh my god. Oh, he ate that. Caught him. Screw that noise. Oh, he has no idea I'm over here. This guy's a psychopath. Let 
Hmm, that's tempting. But this shotgun been doing us well. Oh, this guy's still struggling. Bro, I ain't in your playground. You're in my playground. I'll gladly go in there. Keep your hands, arms, and legs inside the caskets at all times. And keep an eye on them kitties. Ooh. I didn't quite get there in time. It hit my armor though. I'm tear him a new there we go. I had to blind fire that. He didn't know I moved. Oh, he saw me. I'll bet. There you are. Oh, you gotta reload, son. I missed. God damn, that felt good. Hey, motherfucker, Georgie. What you say about Georgie? This is Lincoln Clay. Ain't no Georgie. It's all Lincoln. Bro, I straight up like the Whispering Oaks, though. I got. Right here. We're gonna see what we got. That's intimidating. He comes back, I'll finish him for good. He's the fuck out of me where he went. You can stop looking when he's dead. We search every goddamn corner till we find him. This guy really is dumb. Clapping cheeks, bro. I don't even need to look. Couldn't get right where I wanted, but dang, he's still struggling. Gonna barbecue your ass. Yeah, we'll see about that. Oh, oh snap! He said, you know? <laughs> When they ask me if I wanted aim assist on, are you crazy? Ain't got no gas in it. God, he's such a savage. Well, 
Ain't no trying, brother. It's happening. But we are done with your games, Richie. Come out. No, but I'm gonna take it from you. So dark, I can't see nothing. Now say what you will about the life of a slave, but those days brought the Negro folk closer to God. Saved many a soul from the lake of fire. But soon they started backsliding, returning to the ways of their African hands. I didn't trust it. Oh, this guy's so screwed. Oh, dang, that's so brutal, dude. But this guy, who is this guy talking to? He's just talking to talk. I never even saw that coming. Bro, he didn't bust on the wall. I hit the thing he was up against. Heck. Where'd he go? He broke and ran over there somewhere. I see the dude up in the top, but he don't see me. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I was stuck. This is cool. Got that guy. He took that like a champ. Gotcha.
run this through, boy? You think you can come in here and steal my heroin without nobody noticing? I'm not here to steal your heroin, Richie. I'm here to make you pay for what you did to Sammy and Ellis Robinson. I didn't have nothing to do with it! I watched you stab Ellis in the gut. I couldn't do nothing about it then, but I sure as hell can now. Oh, God damn it! None of that was my idea, you hear? It was all Georgie, him and his old man. They wanted y'all gone, not me. Uh, what was I supposed to do, say no? Either that or make sure that I was dead. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, please, please. Listen, listen, just decent thing would be to let a man get in a prayer before you kill him. You can pray on the way up. When I saw Richie Doucette hanging from that Ferris wheel, I felt a profound sense of disbelief. Nothing like this had ever happened before. The mobsters killed each other all the time, but it was generally a small, contained event. Some greaseball is eating spaghetti and meatballs at his favorite restaurant and gets popped in the head. But this was different. Even then, even before I knew who killed him, I knew that Richie had been put on display. Lincoln was trained in psychological warfare by the CIA. He wanted to terrify the mob, wanted them to know he was going to kill every last one of them and that none of them would be able to stop him. Heck yeah, dude. Complete. You gosh darn right we got him. Is he up there? Yeah, there he is. He's right there. Just uh, generated kickback for the first time. Visible kickback is always shown on the map. What does that mean? It's a portion of your underboss's earn. Improve earn by... Okay. So it's just money. Okay, so we can make some extra money. We're sitting on 18,000 right now on us. That's a crazy fact, by the way, Ace, and I never knew that about uh, Saints Row. What's up, brother? Ain't no real place for us to stop, so we're just gonna pull off right here. Dude, that was such a smooth exit. GTN could learn a thing or two, I'm just saying. How you doing? How you doing? All right, well, you, well, you, you're not supposed to answer his question with the same question. Just saying. Oh, it's that guy. That dude looks cool, or at least the uh, stuff I've seen about him. How you doing? I didn't know that was his name, though. Excuse me. And right, now we're here. Who sets dead? The hollow's yours. They say you strung him up on the old Ferris wheel. He killed Ellis. Shit all over the people in this neighborhood. Doucette got what he deserved. The righteous will rejoice when he sees the vengeance. 
He will bathe his feet in the blood of the wicked. Mm. Mm. That goes both ways, you know. Thought you said all that was behind us. My men are struggling with the notion that we now have to answer to the same men who killed Baca, who wiped out half our number. If I was them, I'd get over it. We don't have time to go around coddling people. Mm, of course not. But gestures carry weight. And if you were to help my man Emmanuel, that's a gesture that would go a long way in calming nerves. What's he need? He oversees my reefer operation over at the boathouse. Help him, and I'll see to it you get a potion of the profits. Just so we're clear, I'm expecting a cut of everything, not just what comes from selling weed. It's gonna cost a lot of money to take down Marcano. Don't worry. I'll make sure you get your money. even more money uh okay yeah i i got nobody else to assign it to so so now we have an optional mission and then the main story is that one right there we go talk to donovan um let's head back to our safe house We'll probably, uh, probably wrap it up on that. Feels like a good place to, you know, end off. Maybe we'll run around, do a little extra hunting and scavenging, and we definitely need to put our money away before, uh, we inevitably, uh, you know, dance with the devil. There it goes. I don't think I've seen that Disney movie. There's a lot. I'm trying to remember what year it was. Or what one of the major, like, last Disney films that I watched before. I kind of... Kind of just got away from it. If I'm being honest. Wait. One, this is where I parked my yellow car, right? This is where I walked in. I walked in here, blasted the uh, one dude, grabbed the other guy. He tried to slip out, right? It's 100% the place. Oh, come on in. Take a look around. Yep, that's what I'm about to do. That's my way out. All right, we're going in, in here. Can I not? Yeah. Please only. Pff, like I care. Passing through, man. Yeah, this is what I saw. Oh, I missed. Yeet. Plant one of these bad boys. We'll cut right back through. Come on now, you know that doesn't belong to you. Let's get here. What? Stop. How did he even know? I literally went to do it because he wasn't here. Oh my god. Well, while he's out on the floor, I'm just gonna... A yoink, uh, $43. Well, I chose the correct one first. He gonna wake up, he gonna be broke. Whoa!
That's where Donovan's at. go it's my car in here where where's my car at that's what i want to know down we go over 20k boom look at that that's hot Gotta put the fit back on. You know how it is. Alright. Well, I think that's a good a place as any to uh, wrap it up.